Best of them hits for all the welcome back, guys. Hey, it's your boy Sean. And your girl. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome, S and M Squad. Yeah. How are you guys doing today? We hope you guys are absolutely amazing. Yes, guys. Hey, if you're having a bad day, let's turn it around right now with some good energy and some information. What we got here today? Most baby? definitely. Okay, guys. Today we'll be reacting to lab grown chicken approved for sale in the U.S. No. Please tell me that's not true. I don't know. Let's yeah, see. It. Let's see. All right, guys, before we get into it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and also turn on your post notification bell so you guys are notified. Babe, let's go ahead and dive into it. Let's go, go, my love. Good energy all day. Damn. Let's go. Let's see what we got here. This is scary. We are back with the new lab grown chicken that was just approved for sale in the U.S. Could be headed to your dinner plate. Devin Dwyer has the details. Good morning, Devin. What? Is that a chicken press? I mean, it looks supposed similar. To be a to a chicken breast, but is it really chicken? What is that? Is that lab grown? That's scary to me. Hold on, guys. That's scary. Hold on, hold on. We are back with the new lab grown chicken that was just approved for sale in the U.S. All right, let's get a shot at that. that it does doesn't not look, right. look right at all. That looks scary. But does it's it taste scary? Leg. Maybe it's good. I don't know. I don't know about that. It doesn't but look it, like it, a chicken breast. It looked like it can just fix somebody else. If you're not really, you know, paying attention, it, you might think that's a real chicken breast. Go home, season it, cook it, eat it. I mean, it looks similar. Here we go, guys. It, it looks very similar. It's just that... I don't know if... Huh? The thick, the fullness... But if you chop something that up isn't, and saute, you would never, you know, how, how, how do you, how Let's just you get know? into Here the video. We'll be headed to your dinner plate. Devin Dwyer has the details. Good morning, Devin. Hey, good morning, George. Americans ate 75 billion pounds of red meat and chicken last year. But what if some of that meat was not raised on farms, but instead of high-tech facilities? Scientists say that could be good for the environment and your health, and soon it could be on menus and store shelves. Oh, okay. This morning, the USDA has approved cell-cultivated meat to be sold to the public for the first time. So that's where it all starts, just a few cells. Two cultivated meat producers now getting the green light to begin commercially selling their chicken, not raised on a farm, but in a facility. The meat is grown using real animal cells and large bioreactors fed with nutrients. I recently got a tour of California-based Upside Foods, the nation's first and largest cultivated meat producer. You're making chicken in there. Yeah, so if you look at this, this is a approximately a 200 plus liter tank. Okay. And we take cells from a chicken or an egg. It takes two weeks to grow the equivalent of one chicken. A thousand chickens or a hundred thousand chickens. So you're saying in this factory you can make what? more meat faster and cleaner than an average farmer? Well, ultimately, yes. The company says cell cultivated meat could help feed the world's booming population using a fraction of the land and water of animal farming and help reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Many experts okay. say more study is needed. I got to try this cell cultivated chicken uh -oh. at the facility in California, guys. I got to say the texture was a little bit different, but it did okay. taste like chicken. The company says they hope to get it on restaurant menus in the next few weeks, then maybe on store shelves in the next five years. And dozens of startup companies are getting in on the game, guys. You mentioned the texture. So is it more like tofu? You know, George, it was pretty close to chicken, uh, but maybe a little bit rubbier. <laughs> rubbier. Uh, okay. Wow. Because I said texture. it doesn't look. Get right. The texture looked a little off. Credit? Like, I think I even though I would have to would. Feel, eat it like myself to tell. But. Animal cruelty, but mm, we'll see. Mm -hmm. The rubbery didn't sell me. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking about becoming a vegetarian. Mm. <laughs> Hi everyone, Joseph Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to All download right. the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching. We all subscribe. Okay. Uh oh. Um, now we got to get into this because lab grown chicken. It sounds like you know they have good intentions as far as. You know, it's healthier, it's better for the environment. Is um, but is it safe for human consumption? 
Well, because. it's crazy because they doing something to the chicken right now. Yes. It's something they done to it. You know, some of that chicken, it just doesn't. And I don't know if this was, you know, real or was it, you know. Um, what else are they using? Because they make, if they, they're they taking the stuff some cells, what, is the, what are these other ingredients to, you know, that are combining together to make this chicken? Because it's not real. So if it's growing, if it's grown in the lab, are the chickens grown in the lab? And they just slaughter like lab chickens or they doing something. I cells. need to know more about they this doing, thing because it sounds like it could be harmful for humans to consume. You know what I'm saying? It's so advanced, like we we would never know the truth. I don't think we would never get the truth, like is it you know like 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 really what's going on out here you know what i'm saying why can't we just eat the regular the, how the chicken is regular i mean and it's like i, I don't know if i want my hungry. chickens grown in a lab <laughs> if they can make all that chicken like that it doesn't no sound appetizing to me i I'll mean tell you that. I'm not trying to, you know, speak negatively on. So why are, are you going to try it? The new version of chicken. Yes, we're going to try it because it's I would be love in the to try it. I mean, I've had worse. I'm telling you. It might be at Chipotle where it's over there and chop it up and season it and throw it in there. We would not. We are from the hood. You know, we have had worse. Okay, yeah. All the type of Chinese joints here, so you know. You know what I'm saying, but um. That's <laughs> crazy. Yeah, lab grown chicken. I'm not too sure about that. Um, you know, black people, we love our chicken now. Don't that play with our chicken. chicken. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to look at it and see if I can see We this. love our chicken, okay? You know, drop it in some flour and fry it and see how it come out. You know, I don't know. but I don't know. What y'all think? Let us know in the comment section. Would you guys try lab-grown chicken? It's coming. It's here. I mean, I would try it. But it doesn't seem too safe. Like it's, it's too. It's in a laboratory, for God's goodness' sakes. You know. I mean, it's chicken period. But I'm pretty sure it's made with certain chemicals as well. It's not just chicken cells. Like, what are you guys doing with these chicken it's cells? Something in it, and there's something. I want to go behind the scenes. It's something that's you know producing this chicken, and this is ran by machines. So right, it's not, you know. It's not real. Most definitely. Straight up and down. It's not real. I mean, can it... It just seems like it can cause harm. If you just look in the lab, it doesn't... Like, who wants food out of the lab? Laboratory. I don't want any this food out of the guys. laboratory. This is a tough one. But you know what? Um, I would think about it to save the population. If it would save the population. So... I'm like in the middle. I mean, not in the middle because I really don't want it, but I'm willing to but try it. I'm willing to try it. If they um put it in the market and, you know. We would know. They got to alert us, right? They got to let us know what. That's what, I guess, that's what know, this is, an alert. The, <laughs> um, USDA Food Administration and all that. They got to <laughs> let us know. Some Somebody got to tell us something. Like, what are we eating? But um, I definitely want to read the comments on this one, guys. All right, so make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up and also get inside the comment section. Are you guys, guys trying the lab-grown chicken? Let, Let us, us know. know. And be I'm careful when you are in the market. Make sure you are watching what you are buying. Yes, and it's supposed to be a shortage in food anyway. So it's like this might, you know, fill up the shelves and in the freezers and stuff. I don't know. You know, I don't want to eat any lab grown chicken and then five months later my kidneys are failing. So you guys let oh, us know. Scary. You know, we wow. I guess we have to try this thing out and see where it goes from there. Yeah, let's try I'm, it out. Let's see what happens. I don't know. Um, seems a little it's, iffy, but it's I'm crazy. willing I'm willing to try it if it will stop, you know, animals from being slaughtered or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I agree with that. Save the population. Yeah, let's get the cells and make them in there and do whatever you guys got to do. If it's safe. Everybody's safe. All right? But it doesn't. I'm Don't not. Don't want to get no salmonella or none of that food poisoning. And, and, Most definitely. You know, mess up your stuff and all in right. the hospital emergency room. Most definitely. Wow. All right, guys. We signing off. That was interesting, though. Right. We about to here. It's your boy, Sean. And your girl. Love the pieces. Now. Bam. We love you.
you guys have an amazing Hell, day amazing. on purpose. On purpose.